Fitness Girls, my name is Eddie and welcome back to my channel or if this is your first time visiting, welcome to my channel, Fire Ever 50. I am so excited to share my next self-tanning review with you with one of my favorite brands, Kula. And uh, I'll be testing three products actually for this video. The first being this tan mousse. Now there is only one shade in this product, um, so I'll be really curious to see just what color actually appears. This product is um, pretty unique. It's not just a self tanner, but it also has an Echo Slim Complex, which is caffeine and ex um, exactly, it's an active blend of green coffee, algae extracts, and sugar beet de um, derived DHA. And this is supposed to um, help you look tan, toned, and tighten. So we'll see how it actually turns out. And this is also, um, as all the cooler products are. It's farm to face, cruelty free, uh, non-GMO, and vegan. So very awesome. And this is 70% plus organic. The second product I'm going to be using is another face product. And with the Tanologist review, um, I was telling you all how I don't usually use face self-tanners. Well, here we go. Here's another one. This is the um, anti-aging face serum. So this has a, a blend of argan oil, vitamin C, and hyaluronic acid along with um, plant stem cell cultures, which is supposed to leave your um, skin, your face, feeling smooth, hydrated, and glowing. The mousse is a one-time use, you know, probably once a week. Um, while this, the face tanner, you can um, use it either as a gradual tanner, you mix it up with your moisturizer and use it daily, or you can just apply it alone for a one-time use. And my third product, since the face serum doesn't have any SPF at all, is the Sun Soak Drops. And this is an SPF 30, so I'll be using this on a daily basis while we're testing out um, how well the self-tanner stays. So before we get started tanning, I just kind of wanted to go over my procedure um, prior to tanning. So the first thing that I do is exfoliate, and I use this Dove exfoliator and it is, this is the um, lavender, crushed lavender and coconut milk. It smells so good. And they have other um, blends as well. And I, this is my little exfoliator glove from Target. And then after I exfoliate in the shower, I'll get out and I'll put in on moisturizer. And the one I'm loving right now is this Nivea Essentially Enriched. Uh, this lotion is so thick and creamy and goes on so smooth and not heavy or greasy at all. And then once I'm done um, exfoliating and paying special attention, you know, to your elbows, your knees, your ankles, wrist, anywhere where you might have like a buildup of any dry skin, make sure you really scrub those areas. You don't want any splotchy marks of tanner. And once we get all done exfoliating and then moisturizing with the lotion, then we'll be ready to start tanning. Okay, so we are going to start with the Sunless Tan Anti-Aging Face Serum. And it says to dispense a small amount into the palm of your hand and then just spread it evenly onto your face, um, onto clean, dry skin. And my face is clean and dry. Um, and it says if you wanted to like build a gradual tan, you could uh, mix it up in your um, regular moisturizer every day and place a small amount and just put it on your face then too. But we want to go for a little quicker um, tan, so we are going to just put it straight on. So let's check it out. So let's go ahead, look how cute this little bottle is. Let's go ahead, open this up. It's got a little pump, and I am going to pump some in my hand, and it is a clear gel, kind of clear gel, and I'm just going to, I'm going to look at my mirror here and just put it on my face. It's really light. I'm going to get some of my ears too. And now my neck, the back of my neck. I'm going to get a wipe and just wipe my hands a little bit here and get some more so I don't get it all over the bottle. And you can just see it here. And on my forehead, up into my hairline. It just smells so good. And you know, not too overpowering, like you're like, Ugh, it's too much. No, it smells really good. Okay, so I'm gonna let that dry and then we're gonna start 
with the body tan. Now I am gonna go wash my hands because I wanna make sure I don't get um, tan on my hands and I don't know how strong this is, so I'll be right back. Wash my hands, they are clean. And next thing, we wanna make sure we put lotion um, onto our elbows, our knees, the tops of our feet, our hands, anywhere where you think you might get some dark um, splotching from the tanner. I recommend this Nivea um, Essentially Enriched 48 Hour Lotion. It is so thick and creamy, but not heavy at all and not greasy. And it's just got a real light scent. Um, again, nothing really strong, but for a drugstore lotion, I just love it. So I'm going to put it all over my elbows, and the tops of my hands, and don't forget the in-betweens of your fingers. And you know, I'm going to put it all on my palms as well, even though I'm going to have a mitt on because I always manage to get tanner on my hands. I mean, I don't know how I do it, but I do it. All right, so let's get the feet tan mitt on. I just love this matte mitt, matte. But let's put that in see what this looks like. Oh, wow. So this was the exact opposite of the Tanologist, which was really um, dark. This is um, fairly thick, but not anywhere near as thick as the Tanologist. This is kind of meringue almost. And I mean, it looks like meringue too. It's very white, which is surprising. And I am just going to Put it on my arms. Tops of my hands. Under my arms. Now this I feel like it's not real runny but you want to be a little careful when you're putting it on um, if you don't have a towel or something down on the ground so that you just don't, don't get it anywhere you don't want it. I will put it on my chest and you can see I still have those tan lines from before. So I'm going to go put the rest of this on and I'll be back. Oh, and I wanted to make sure uh, to pass along when you're doing your elbows, your knees, uh, make sure you bend them before you, well, as you're putting the tanner on. That way it'll get into all of your little skin crevices. So it says to wait an hour for it to develop and about two to three hours to fully develop. And then um, to take a shower, you need to wait about six to eight hours. So it's late afternoon for me, so I will take a shower this evening, and I will be back in the morning and let you all see how it looks. Fingers crossed. It's just so hard for me to imagine this white foam um, making you tan. And I will try um, in about three hours or so, if the lighting is good enough, to take some pictures to see what it looks like at that point um, compared to my before pictures. I am back now and actually it is the next day. Um, we had a little storm come in so the lighting was pretty horrible. But anyway, I haven't put any makeup on my face yet. I just wanted to show you all um, how good it's actually worked. I am so surprised. And you can see, um, you know, I still have my tan lines here, but overall, I am so much darker than I had anticipated, um, especially my face. So um, I guess you can't always judge um, just looking at the foam or the gel. Well, it did smell just a little tiny bit as I was applying it, but really not bad at all. And there was no like, horrible smell while it was developing or anything like that. I hope this was helpful to you if you're considering um, one of the Kula self-tanning products or just wondering which one you should try. I would definitely put this one on your list. I know it's a little pricier than others, but um, it really seems to work really nicely. It, it surprised me. Like I said, I wasn't expecting a whole lot after I had put it on, but um, getting up this morning, I was like, hmm, it looks pretty good. What I really did like about this product or products was this golden tan color. And while I really love the darker brown from the Tenologist, I think this color is a really nice all season color. It'll move you into fall and still look really nice. Let me know in the comments um, of any other self-tanners you'd like me to try or your experiences um, with this one. 
Thanks so much for watching this video and I hope it was helpful to you. And if it was, please hit that like button and the subscribe button. I can't wait to see you next week. I'll be posting videos weekly uh, with more beauty tips and reviews, fashion, fitness, and even a little food, all especially for us ladies north of 50. Much love. Have a gorgeous day. Bye-bye.